Evelyn. My name is Sharon Clatworthy and I'm one of the Woodwinds tutors for the Tees Valley Music Service. And I'm here today to tell you about the different woodwind instruments you have a chance to play with the music service. Starting with this. This is the flute. Now I know it's made out of metal, but flutes used to be made more commonly out of wood, which is why they count as woodwind. Flute usually gets to play in the nice high tunes. Next we have the clarinet. Now the clarinet actually is made out of wood, but the clarinet needs this to make it work. This is a single reed, which is attached to the clarinet with the ligature, and without which the clarinet doesn't play. This is what a clarinet sounds like. Next is this instrument. Looks very similar to the clarinet, made out of the same kind of wood. Slightly thinner, but it has one big difference, and that's the bit at the top. The clarinet needed a single reed to make it work. This instrument, the oboe, needs a double reed, which is two pieces of reed tied together, which make a little squeak on their own. When you put them in the oboe, sound like this. Next comes this. Now, this is the saxophone. The saxophone is made out of brass, but it doesn't count as a brass instrument because it has a mouthpiece with a reed, just like the clarinet, and it has finger keys very similar to the flute. But because it's made out of brass, the saxophone can be an awful lot louder. <laughs> the saxophone. But I don't play any of those instruments when I play in orchestras. When I play in orchestras, I play this. This is the bassoon. The bassoon is about five foot tall, but it's actually longer than it looks because it starts there, goes the tube goes down one side, actually bends around the bottom and comes out the other side. And because it's actually such a long tube, the bassoon can play some really low notes. I'll play you a quick tune on the bassoon so you can hear what it sounds like on its own. So that's a quick overview of the woodwind family.